The sinking laser needs a line of sight. What's the fastest route? The upper entrance. Target the base before the Geth can organize resistance. What about you? We will deactivate defense systems and acquire an escape vehicle. You can do that? This unit still carries remnants of the old machine upgrade code. We can break any Geth security. You are concerned. Hell yes, I'm concerned. You're still hooked up to the Reapers. No, we simply carry code upgrades that make us more effective, more intelligent. But you lied. I was understanding when you sprang those Geth Primes on me, but you just keep lying. Damn it, Legion, what do I have to do to gain your trust? We did not intend to cause offense. How'd we get here? <sighs> the Geth are better than this. No. Based on empirical evidence, they are not. <sighs> Proceed to the upper entrance. We will exit here and procure an escape vehicle. Got it. I can't believe it. I don't think it's really sunk in yet. The home world. My world. Look at the sky. And the rock formations. They used to write poems about them. Stay sharp. It's not your world yet. Yes, it is. It's tied to us. Our whole culture has been built around this place. You've heard me say, Kilasalai. The best translation I can come up with is, by the home world I hope to see someday. Looks like you're seeing it today. The living room window will be right here. Something I should know? I just claimed the land. I know it doesn't mean much, but when this is over, I'll have a home. Guarian spent centuries as nomads. You think you can go back to living in one place? We have gotten used to carrying our homes around with us. Well, that's a start.
good work.
Blast shield over the base. Blast shield controls. I know Legion's on our side, but Reaper code? No, Legion's on our side. Never thought I'd hear you say that. I've hit the override. We have gained system access and are bypassing security. Stand by.
Shepard, Commander. You have successfully opened the blast shield doors. Good. We'll be back out in a minute. Negative. The path behind you has been sealed. A nearby elevator can take you to the upper level. From there, you should have an acceptable line of sight for targeting. Getting anything from the base? No. The old machines have not registered us as a threat. We recommend haste. The creator fleet will be overrun unless you suffer the Geth connection to the old machines soon. This battle was centuries in the making. To see it finally end. We'll get it done. The Geth stay under Reaper control and the Quarians are dead. This ends now. Edie, patch the Quarians to the Normandy's weapon system. I want the targeting laser synced up to the whole damn fleet. Understood. Do you need assistance? Just stay down, Legion. I'll take it from here. Shepard Commander. Good luck. 
Acknowledged. Shepard to fleet. I'll paint the weak spot. Link up with the Normandy and be ready to fire. You know who I am? Harbinger speaks of you. You resist, but you will fail. The cycle must continue. What are you talking about? We stopped Sovereign and the Geth. We stopped Harbinger and the Collectors. We've earned a straight answer. It is not a thing you can comprehend. We might surprise you. everyone in the galaxy to save us? The cycle must continue. There is no alternative. Organics and synthetics don't have to destroy each other. The battle for Rannoch disproves your assertion. Finish your war. We will be waiting. We did it. We killed a Reaper. Kila. We can confirm that the Geth are no longer being directed by the old machines. 
we are free. You did it, Shepard. The Geth fleet has stopped firing. They're completely vulnerable. Shepard Commander, the Geth only acted in defense after the Creators attacked. Do we deserve death? What are you suggesting? Our upgrades. With the old machine dead, we could upload them to all Geth without sacrificing their independence. You want to upload the Reaper code? That would make the Geth as smart as when the Reaper was controlling them. Yes, but with free will, each Geth unit would be a true intelligence. We would be alive, and we could help you. Our fleet is already attacking. Uploading the code would destroy us. Shepard, you can't choose the Geth over my people. Do you remember the question that caused the creators to attack us, Talizora? Does this unit have a soul? Upload the code to the Geth. Tally, call off the fleet if you can. Uploading. 10%. This is Admiral Talizora. All units, break off your attack. Delay that order. Continue the attack. 20%. I beg you, do not do this. Please. We regret the deaths of the creators, but we see no alternative. 40%. Legion, keep going. Shepard? Everyone listen up. This is Shepard. If you don't want to be blown out of the sky in about half a minute, stand down now. This is Admiral Talizora. Shepard speaks with my authority. And mine as well. Negative. We can win this war now. Keep firing. 60%. The Geth are about to return to full strength. If you keep attacking, they'll wipe you out. A few years ago, I saved you from the Geth at the Citadel. Just recently, I helped you take out that Dreadnought. 80%. But I'm through saving you. If you keep attacking, I will stand and watch while the Geth lay you to waste. It's your call. Keel us alive. All units, hold fire. Error. Copying code is insufficient. Direct personality dissemination required. Shepard Commander, I must go to them. I'm... I'm sorry. It's the only way. Legion, the answer to your question was yes. I know, Tally. But thank you. Kill us and I. Admiral Ron, I heard your ship made a crash landing. Glad you got out in one piece. I was listening over the radio. If Han Gerl hadn't stopped... He did. We have taken heavy losses. I don't know if we can. Where are we supposed to go? You are welcome to return to Rannoch, Admiral Ron, with us. Legion? No, I'm sorry, Commander. Legion sacrificed itself to give us all intelligence. It will be honored. Good. And we will honor Legion's promise. The Geth fleet will help you retake Earth, and our engineers will assist in building the Crucible. As will ours, of course. Admiral, had you considered possible settlement sites? We... The southern continent had excellent farmland. As I recall. Are you gonna be okay? I believe so, Commander. Thank you. Shopping for another house? Beachfront property. Claim it fast. It's a buyer's market. <sighs>
okay? I know working with the Geth will be difficult. I'm not staying. I'm coming with you. I wasn't gonna ask. I think you've earned a few favors with the fleet. I'm asking them to launch an assault on the Reapers. Figured that makes us even. If the Reapers were going to stay on Earth, sure. But sooner or later, they'll come to Rannoch. We did just kill one of them. So I'm coming with you to stop them. If you think I can help. You sure about this? Yeah. I look at all this. This picture of hope and peace. And all I see is everyone I've lost. My team on Haystrom, my father, even Legion. I'm mourning again. How crazy is that? It's not crazy at all. It is beautiful, though, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It'll be years before we can live without our suits completely. But right now... Right now, I have this. Commander Shepard, I understand you are bringing a new fleet into this war. Yes, Counselor. Two, in fact. I've read the reports. I can't believe you convinced both sides to stand down. I had a lot of help. We're still facing isolated pockets of Geth. They appear to be Geth bodies loaded with Reaper code. But they're a minor threat relative to the full Geth fleet. Regardless, Commander, you've given us the first reason to hope in this war. Speaking of which, I have information for you vital to the war effort. I'd prefer to share it in person. What if I come to the Citadel? That would be preferable, Commander. Meet me in Counselor Udina's office. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCon. Commander, something on your mind? What's our state of readiness, Admiral? We're getting there. And with the Reapers pressing their advantage across all fronts, we don't have a lot of time to catch up. What about the extra help we picked up along the way? Bringing in both the Quarians and the Geth has helped us immeasurably. The Quarian fleet is providing evac and fire support, while the Geth attack Reaper supply lines. What about the Turians and Krogan? The Krogan and Turians have obviously been a big help. Erdnog Rex running the show is a bonus for us. And that female Krogan you rescued is rallying more support from the other clans. I'm glad you disabled that mom and Tachanka. We could have lost a lot of Krogan support as it is. We picked up some Turian troops. Good to hear. How about the Asari and Salarians? Since the coup attempt, the Asari have stepped up to the plate. They're committing fleets and sending a science team to work on the Crucible. And the Salarians? They sent the entire fleet as a thank you for rescuing their counselor. Plus, she seems to like you for getting her that job that got us the STG task force. I guess they managed to overlook the Genophage cure. What about Arya's mercenaries? Arya Talok, there's someone I never thought we'd be in bed with. The blood pack will be useful and violent. Mostly Vorcha, I hear. We'll put the Blue Suns to good use. Intel says Narnir Vosk is bringing his men, and that they're gunning for a fight. The Eclipse are providing troops and mechs. When we find a Reaper soft spot, they'll help us hit it. Don't want to know how you got Arya's cooperation, but whatever you did, it was worth it. What's the Reaper situation? It's not trending well even if you did buy Rannoch some time. Our threat projections show the Reapers will gain the advantage on most other fronts. And now the Asari are a prime target. They're the most advanced race in the galaxy. We'll soon find out if that means anything. If I may, Admiral, I have a personal question. Speak freely, Commander. Why me? Why put me in charge of all this? 
Because you're the only soldier in this whole damn Navy who knows how to kill Reapers. Well, you just have to be smart and hope you get lucky. Anyone can figure it out. Your dossier says otherwise, Shepard. I'm well aware of your actions on Torfin all those years ago, wiping out the Batarian prisoners. It came with a cost and ruffled a lot of feathers, but you made the tough call and got the job done. And because of that, you think I qualify to save the galaxy? Shepard, let me tell you something that I've learned the hard way. You can pay a soldier to fire a gun, you can pay him to charge the enemy and take a hill, but you can't pay him to believe. I don't follow, sir. When you went up against Sovereign, there was no good reason to believe you'd win. But your crew didn't seem to care, they went along anyway. Your trip through the Omega-4 Relay? That was a suicide mission, if there ever was one. Yet there your crew was, standing beside you, proud to serve. Why? Because they believed in you, their leader. That's what I need now. Where we're taking them is liable to get pretty hairy, and I know you're the one who will get us to the other side. Nothing more, sir. Hack it out. You've got a new message at your private terminal. I hear you were on the ground with the Reaper. He fired up at us a few times. Joker pulled the Normandy through some insane maneuvers to stay out of the line of fire. It's hard being in a fight like that, especially when you're not the one flying the ship. Joker's one of the best, though. At first I was nauseous, swinging around in my safety harness. But then I was furious. Just... <sighs> enraged. I wanted that thing dead. You didn't want the Reapers dead when they attacked Earth? I wanted them defeated. I wanted Earth saved. But I never wanted to physically tear them in half and watch them blow up. Congratulations, trainer. I believe you've discovered your fight-or-flight instinct. Perhaps I should have stayed with Chess. Although now I think I'm spoiled by the lack of explosions. Commander? it to you, Commander. That's the first time I've seen someone end a war by yelling. I hope that if Tally could see reason, then the rest of the Quarians might listen, too. I had hoped my cooperation with Tally, along with Legions, would help her question her socialized prejudice. Yeah, kind of hard to dehumanize someone who's right there guarding your back. And now we've got two fleets for the price of one. We didn't lose anybody. Except Legion, before it sacrificed itself. Legion referred to itself as I instead of we. Yeah? So? 
The singular pronoun indicates Legion's independent personality had fully actualized. In its last moments, it was not an avatar of the Geth Consensus. It was a person. That's what I figured. Well, when the Geth fleet helps us retake Earth, I guess we'll owe that to... him. It's on your mind, Edie. I was just reflecting. The Quarian's historical era was not making the Geth enough like them. I'm not sure I understand. Units with networked intelligences will trend toward cooperation for mutual benefit. But units with central heuristics establishing an individual personality, such as myself, develop preferences. These preferences form attachments that keep my calculations from devaluing the worth of the lives aboard the Normandy. You're saying the Geth turned on the Quarians because they aren't individuals? That is my theory. But it is limited to a sample size of one society. The only other notable synthetic society is the Reapers, and we do not know if they govern by consensus as the Geth do. Do me a favor. Don't ask them. Hello, Shepard. Another Reaper gone, and peace between the Geth and Quarians. It's amazing. And now my people have a world to fight for. Something they know will last forever. So long as you and the Geth remain good neighbors. They're not our servants anymore. I'm not sure what we should call them. Allies? Friends? There's still too many wounds on either side. But maybe one day... The Migrant Fleet and the Geth warships have joined Admiral Hackett. Feel free to look around. A pleasure to see you. Peace between the Geth and Quarians. Who would have thought? Not how I ever imagined that would turn out. And next you'll be telling me the Krogan and Turians are cooperating. Oh, right. You managed that one too. You're a peacemaker, Shepard. A rare thing these days. Now, if you can pacify the Reapers, we'll make you a saint. Not sure if having an army of Geth behind us gives me confidence or makes me feel like there's a target on my back. Not right now. Good to see you, Commander. Got the flush. Mmm. Full house. Caught it on the river. Shit. Thought you were bluffing on the flush. Good for you. Cannon, Lieutenant. <laughs> yes, sir, Major Alenko, sir. Shepard, I'd deal you in, but Vega just cleaned me out. Oh, come on. That really as deep as your pockets go? No sentimental crap stowed away? Investments? I got some land on the Sunshine Coast I could put up. 
<laughs> I'll pass. That was quite the negotiation you pulled off. And having both the Quarians and the Geth on our side? That's a very good thing. Totally took down a Reaper. Yep. Sure did. Yes, you did. Hell yeah. And you know, I'm just gonna have to go with you on trusting the Geth. I hope it works out. Now let's talk later. Hey, Commander. Another Reaper has died. You are proving that humans are capable soldiers. But I question this peace you have brokered. No such thing is possible between machines and organics. I would have destroyed the synthetics without hesitation. And these Quarians, let's just hope they are reliable allies. It is difficult to trust a species that hides behind masks. The only conflict you should concern yourself with is ending the one with the Reapers. Diplomacy does not win wars. Powerful and plentiful firearms do. Seeing all these primitives flying spaceships is... unexpected and very dangerous. Do not care what others think. Do what you must. on every woman's figure but mine. Well, I... What? You don't like my legs? Gabby, it, it's you. You know? No, chicken shit, I don't know. All you do is make stupid sexist comments to avoid saying anything real. Gabby, now's not the time. We've got work to do. Responsibilities. Ah, grow a pair, Ken. Look around you. Tomorrow may not come. Something to say or no? Gabby... Please, we have a duty to the ship and the crew. What about us? Just... <sighs> listen to yourself. Kenneth, you comment on every woman's figure but mine. Well, I... What? You don't like my legs? Gabby, it it's you. You know? No, chicken shit, I don't know. All you do is make stupid sexist comments to avoid... This is a military vessel, Daniels. Start acting like it. Aye, aye, Commander. Yes, ma'am. All good, Commander. Commander? Can't be. No. I guess that's right. Hey, Tally. How's it going? Oh, sorry. I didn't hear you. I just got communication from the fleet. Sorry, uh, from Rannoch. In the old days, I'd send any new technology I found back to the fleet. I should probably be doing that with the agriculture samples now. I, I don't know anything about raising crops. How are your people doing? It's crazy. The Geth are helping, setting up housing, adapting power systems. They are doing in weeks what would have taken us years. Geth are even uploading into the suits of Quarian volunteers. They're rewriting environmental functions, jumpstarting our immune systems. That doesn't seem possible. The Geth are software, not hardware. They can transfer themselves from a normal body into anything with enough processing power. They're mimicking infections, so the host can adapt without getting sick. It's like making a vaccine. Isn't that close to what happened before the Geth rebelled last time? 
Yes, but this time, the Geth and the Quarians have chosen it. That's not to say there aren't issues. What if no Geth wants to augment Admiral Geralt because of his role in the war? And who decides on something that affects the suit? But as problems go, I'll take them over what we had. Today, on Rannoch, there are Quarian children who will grow up healthy and strong, thanks to the Geth. They owe that to you. No. I'd have killed the Geth with no regrets. And I'd have been wrong. Thank you. I can't believe my people are working with the Geth. The Geth are helping us rebuild. I never thought I'd see it. Our scientists and the Geth have done amazing work on the Crucible together. Hey, Shepard. Commander, I'm doing a segment on the Geth Quarian War. It should take maybe an hour. Can we talk in your cabin? Trainer, can you send up Diana Allers? She wants to talk to me. She's on her way, Commander. I'm sure you've got a million questions. I narrowed it down to 40. Let's see how you do with the top 10. Commander, the last time most of us heard about Geth, they were attacking the Citadel alongside Sovereign. Yes, and you should know that was a minority of the Geth. Most of them are not hostile to organics. Is that how you explain that they're allies and no longer dangerous robots who stick humans on spikes? What you have to realize is that despite their reputation, most Geth are not inherently violent. The Quarians attacked them. The Geth fought back in self-defense just like any organic would. Now that we've freed the Geth from Reaper control, they'll want payback for their enslavement. But you're going to take an army of synthetics to fight Reapers with untold hacking abilities. What's keeping the Reapers from reprogramming the Geth like they have before? The Geth are extremely intelligent and they've put incredible thought into solving this problem. They're not gonna turn again. I'd bet my life on it. Now here's a question from a Batarian on Omega. Commander Shepard, if the mass relays can be destroyed... So did I miss anything? Do you have any questions? You gonna go file your story now? Well, if you don't mind. Go tell the galaxy what we've done. I could use some good news. Aye aye, Commander. Thank you. 